Hello, I'm Becca from Imagineif Libraries. You are out and about with Imagineif, and today I am at Summers Middle School in their band room because our March Storytime Takeout is all about music. So I want to show you some of the things that we have in that kit. Um, they are available at all of our locations, Big Fork, Columbia Falls, and Kalispell, while supplies last. And if you've picked one up already, you can go ahead and get the two little rhythm sticks that we put in that kit and get those out so that you're ready to play with me. Um, we did include a little tiny um, pot of paint. So if you want to paint your rhythm sticks, that's what that you can use that for. Um, so the first story that I'm going to read is called Two Sticks, just like these. And it's got a really nice rhythm and beat to the whole story. And it repeats a lot of words. So you can get your sticks out and kind of tap along to the rhythm of the story. All right, so this is Two Sticks. The author is Aurel Prado-Popescu, and um, the illustrator is Anne Wilsdorf. Two sticks. All right, is everybody ready to play their sticks? Here we go. Two sticks, two sticks. Maybell played with two sticks. Two bounce like kangaroo sticks. Two drum de dum de do sticks. Two, two times two is four sticks. Two on a wooden floor sticks. Can you play your sticks on the floor? To beat them on a door sticks. To make your parents sore sticks. They said, girl, stop that fake drum, that shaking us awake drum, that giving us an ache drum, that this we cannot take drum. But Maybell wanted some drum, a kettle, snare, not humdrum, a drum dee dum dee dum dee drum drum, oh, any funky fun fun drum. She ran off to a new beat, a hip hopping shoe by shoe beat, a Maybell through and through beat, a wake up the bayou beat. Her sticks picked out a neat beat, a rake the fence repeat beat, a drumming on the street beat, faster than her feet beat. I heard some rhyming words in that, did you? She played upon a bare log, a cross me if you dare log, a rotten I don't care log, a Maybell doesn't scare log. Hmm, is there something else besides logs in this picture? Do you see them? Her sticks were making potholes, Swiss cheesy scatter shot holes, big would she fall or not holes, till there was nothing but holes. Down she goes. She fell into a vile swamp, a slimy crocodile swamp, a reptiles by the mile swamp, a do your best to smile swamp, and she only had two sticks her tried and trusty two sticks. To beat them where they chew sticks, to beep up a do dang do sticks. Each tooth rang with a round sound, each cavity profound sound, a deep down underground sound, in crocodile surround sound. I think she's playing the crocodile's teeth. She played a toothy dance tune, a crocodile romance tune, a keep them in a trance tune, a please give me a chance tune. Eleven scaly tails swung, 10,000 shiny scales swung, the females and the males swung, their clicking clacking nails swung. She played that grinning pack home. With pride, she brought them back home, all dancing on the track home, to every click and clack home. Her folks and neighbors woke up. They jumped with every stroke up. When Maybell's music broke up, she clicked her sticks and spoke up. 
I finally found the right drum. A ringing, singing, bright drum. A crocodile won't bite drum. A bing, bang, dynamite drum. Her, par her parents had to cheer now. They wouldn't interfere now. Choose any drum, my dear now. Just get them out of here now. They don't want those crocodiles to be drums anymore. So Maybelle got a real drum, a big calypso steel drum, a musical ideal drum, a pinging swinging feel drum. She played it with her two sticks, two lollipop like new sticks, two bounce like kangaroo sticks, two drum dee dum dee doo sticks. Now she could ping and pong sticks, ding as well as dong sticks, bim bam all day long sticks, and never lose her song. Bing banga dooby daba, so long. And that's the end. All right, so let's sing a little tapping stick song. This is a fun song by Kathy Reed Nyman, and it's found on her album, I Love to Hear the Sound. You can find it on YouTube. And are you ready with your sticks? It goes like this. I'm tapping on my sticks, tapping on my sticks, tapping, tapping, never stopping, tapping on my sticks. Can you play on the floor? I'm tapping on the floor, I'm tapping on the floor, tapping, tapping, never stopping, tapping on the floor. Now tap them up in the air. I'm tapping in the air, I'm tapping in the air, tapping, tapping, never stopping, tapping in the air. Can we play even faster? Let's tap them very quickly. I'm tapping very quickly, I'm tapping very quickly, tapping, tapping, never stopping, tapping very quickly. There you go. So you could add some other ones in there. You could play loud, you could play quietly, you could alternate your hands and tap them like this. Or maybe you want to rub your sticks together. Try some different things out. All right. Look at this instrument behind me. It's kind of like a chime. Shall we see what it sounds like? Pretty cool. And behind me, there's some other things that you can tap. They sound a little bit different, don't they? Don't they? So I have some um, friends that are going to join me. They are students in the band here at Summers Middle School, and they are going to help me with a game. All right. Okay, it's time to play a game. We're going to see if you can guess what instrument is playing. And we have some different ones listed on here. We've got a piano, a flute, a clarinet, a drum, a trumpet, and a xylophone. So let's listen carefully and see if we can figure out what instrument is playing now. What do you think that is? Hmm, let's take a look. I'm gonna turn the camera around and we'll see who's playing. It was the clarinets playing. This one right here. All right, so I'm gonna take that down. And let's see if we can figure out what is playing next. Are you ready? Listen carefully. sounded a lot higher than the clarinets, didn't it? I wonder who was playing that. Let's take a look. That was the flutes. The flutes are a very, very high sounding instrument, aren't they? So I'm going to take the flute down. And what do we have left? We have the piano, drum, a trumpet, and a xylophone. Let's listen carefully and see what's playing next. Hmm, that's a little bit different than both the flute and the clarinet. Do you have a guess? Let's turn the camera around and see who's playing. That was the trumpet. This one right there. 
So we've heard clarinet, flute, and trumpet. I wonder which one we'll hear next. Let's listen carefully and see what you think it is. Hmm, what do you think? Does anybody have a guess? Let's turn the camera around and see who's playing that sound. Did you guess the drum? Yep, that was the drum. All right, let's see. I have two more instruments here on my board. I have the piano and the xylophone. Let's listen carefully and see if we can figure out which one is playing now. Hmm, what do you think? Is that a xylophone or a piano? All right, let's go find. All right, did you guess that that was the xylophone? I think it sounds a little bit like the piano, but that was the xylophone. So that's it for our game. Thank you to the Summers Band students that helped me out today. Bailey, Tessa, Jocelyn, Allie, Karis, and Grayson. All right, that was pretty great. Were you able to tell what those instruments were? Which one was your favorite? What do you think about this ginormous drum behind me? Look how big it is. You can't even see all of it. And here is the, the mallet that you hit it with. Wow, that makes a really low sound, doesn't it? All right, so we're gonna read one more story and you're gonna need the egg shaker that was in your kit. So a little imaginative egg shaker is also in that story time takeout kit this month and um, get ready to shake it to go along with the story called The Animal Boogie. Now this can also be found on YouTube as a song. So if you wanna look this up after I read the story, you can hear what it sounds like as a song. The Animal Boogie by Debbie Harder and Fred Penner. It's a barefoot book. Here we go. Listen for the word shake and you can shake your egg. Here we go. Down in the jungle, come if you dare. What can you see shaking here and there? With a shaky shake here and a shaky shake there, what's that creature shaking over there? What do you think? What do you think that animal is? It's pretty fuzzy. It's a bear. She goes, shake, shake, boogie, woogie, oogie. Shake, shake, boogie, woogie, oogie. Shake, shake, boogie, woogie, oogie. That's the way she's shaking over there. Down in the jungle where nobody sees, what can you see swinging through the trees? With a swingy swing here and a swingy swing there, what's that creature swinging through the trees? What do you think? I see a tail. Could it be a monkey? He goes swing, swing, boogie, woogie, oogie. Swing, swing, boogie, woogie, oogie. Swing, swing, boogie, woogie, oogie. That's the way he's swinging through the trees. Down in the jungle in the midday heat, what can you see stomping its feet? With a stompy stomp here and a stompy stomp there, what's that creature stomping its feet? Those are some big feet. What do you think? Is it an elephant? Yeah. Can you stomp your feet? She goes stomp, stomp, boogie, woogie, oogie. Stomp, stomp, boogie, woogie, oogie. Stomp, stomp, boogie, woogie, oogie. That's the way she's stomping her feet. Down in the jungle where the trees grow high, what can you see flying in the sky? With a flappy flap here and a flappy flap there, what's that creature flying in the sky? Well, what flies? What do you think? Can you see the wings? There it is. It's a beautiful blue bird. It goes flap, flap, boogie, woogie, oogie. Flap, flap, boogie, woogie, oogie. Flap, flap, boogie, woogie, oogie. That's the way he's flying in the sky. 
Down in the jungle where the leaves lie deep, what can you see learning how to leap? With a leapy leap here and a leapy leap there, what's that creature learning how to leap? Hmm, can you think of an animal that leaps and maybe has some spots? It's a leopard. She goes leap, leap, boogie, woogie, oogie. Leap, leap, boogie, woogie, oogie. Leap, leap, boogie, woogie, oogie. That's the way she's learning how to leap. How high can you leap? Can you leap like a leopard? Down in the jungle where there's danger all around, what can you see slithering on the ground? Hmm, what kind of animal slithers on the ground? With a slither slither here and a slither slither there, what's that creature slithering on the ground? It's a snake. He goes slither slither boogie woogie oogie, slither slither boogie woogie oogie, slither slither boogie woogie oogie. That's the way he's slithering on the ground. Down in the jungle where the stars are shining bright, who can you see? swaying left and right with a sway sway here and a sway sway there who is swaying left and who is swaying right who is it we are we go sway sway boogie woogie oogie sway sway boogie woogie oogie sway sway boogie woogie oogie that's the way we boogie through the night There they all are. They're doing the animal boogie. Boogie is just another word for dance. Do you like to dance? All right. You can stomp your feet when you dance. You can leap up high. Yep. You do all of those different movements. So the last item in the takeout story time kit is a ribbon dancer that you can use for dancing. And it might even fit around your wrist. If you didn't get one of these kits and you want to make a ribbon dancer, super easy to do. You just need some ribbon, maybe some bells, and a hairband works really well for um, using for the ring. And then you can even slip it over your wrist. So our takeout kit includes two bells, some pipe cleaners that will make it easier to wrap that bell around the ring, and some ribbons. All right. So thank you for joining me today. Let's end our musical story time with a favorite song we sing at the library, Zoom, Zoom, Zoom. And if you have your ribbon dancer with you, you can put it on your hand and sing with me. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Five, four, three, two, one, blast off. Bye everyone.